Hi guys. Hi. This is my friend Pila and we are doing another great video. So for Thanksgiving, everybody has the leftover turkey and what we're going to do is make turkey noodle soup. Okay. So in order to do that, and this is the Lizzie recipe, this is not an online recipe. This is just me and Pila trying to figure it out together. And so what we need is, what do we need first? So, yeah. it's okay, you're fine. It's just, it's just like us in the kitchen, sweetie. You can say, you can show them the noodles. Okay, we're gonna need these kind of noodles. Yep, show it up to the camera, there you go. Egg noodles, okay, and then what? We're gonna need carrots. Okay, don't drop them. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> and we're gonna need some carrots, you guys. Also, Obviously. Turkey. turkey. We're gonna need some turkey. We've got a lot of turkey. So what you want to do with the turkey oh, is and um, celery yeah. and celery. <laughs> and so what you want to do with the turkey is you want to take it off the bone and everything like that. So it's um, deboned, deboned turkey. And then they didn't have turkey broth, so I'm using the chicken broth. Okay. And also seasonings. I got a bunch. I got onion. I got the chicken. I got garlic. I love garlic. Who doesn't love minced garlic? We got garlic salt, right? Don't you love garlic, Pila? I got salt and pepper. Okay, so now the first thing we're gonna do is we're always gonna rinse. Can you guys see? Let's do this a little bit like this. Better, better. Yeah. I hope the volume is okay, you guys, just because I really should have got a mic. I did not get a mic, but I should have got a mic because it's so far away. Because this is my new kitchen and we're doing this new. So I'm trying it and hopefully you guys can hear it, hear my uh, voice. I'm gonna talk louder so that way there you guys can hear. Yeah. Um, so I'm gonna rinse the vegetables and Peel is gonna start chopping. So I have a lot, what kind of knife do you want? Um, the bigger one? I'll just take any knife. Any knife? Let's yeah. see. This one good? Yeah. Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure you got it, or do you want a smaller one? I'll get a smaller. Oh, one. smaller. <laughs> the length of the blade is taller. Yeah. Maybe something like this. Yeah. You think that'll work? Okay. Do you know how to do it? Okay. So what you want to do is you cut this end off. So she's gonna cut. Let me move this out of the way. Can you guys see that? Okay. So what you want to do is you're gonna cut this end off right here. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna cut that off. Okay, so you get that off, get the end off, right? And then you don't want these things in here. So on each one, you're gonna cut them, like right, you're gonna hold it right here, and then cut right there. Yeah, good job. Yeah, and then you do that to all of them, and then you cut them in little, yep, like this. You want little sizes like that. So she's gonna cut them in little sizes like this. That's what she's gonna do. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the egg noodles. And now what you don't wanna do, you guys, is you don't wanna put the egg noodles in with your broth. You wanna cook them on the side. So that's what I'm gonna do. I don't know if I can flip the camera here. Let's see, you guys can see a, oh, well, of my place. Where's my place? Okay. So. See of my place. My place is actually looking cute, you guys. So I throw the egg rolls in here. And obviously, I didn't open it well with my teeth. Okay, and put the. There we go. So I'm going to cook the egg noodles separate. I don't know if you guys can see. Get that out of the way. There you go. And you don't want the egg noodles to cook for, hold on. Let me get a spoon. Huh? You're doing good, honey? Yeah. Okay, good. This stuff smells good too. Oh yeah, she loves the smell of it. So I'm gonna pour some salt in there. Just get some salt to pour into the egg noodles. You can never have too much salt. Okay, and I'm gonna let those cook separately, like I said. And you don't wanna cook them all the way. Okay. Boom. Look at how easy that was. 
I'm getting fancy dancy with this thing. Okay, so yeah, that's good slices. So another thing is, is let me get a plate. So what I'm going to do with the turkey is you kind of want to cut the turkey into little uh, chunks or pieces or whatever. You don't want a big pieces. So you cut these in little pieces. So Pila, do you want to say anything to your audience? Now you got a bunch of audience members. You have a TikTok, right? Yep. You have TikTok? What's your TikTok uh, channel about? It's just kind of goofy clips that I do. Yeah? Well, I will definitely put her TikTok uh, information in the link, and you guys can follow Pila. Is it follow or is it subscribe? It's follow. It's follow. <laughs> I have no clue. I have no clue at all. So you can definitely follow her on TikTok. Yeah, so what are some of the things you do? Just goofy little clips, you said? Yeah. Like what? Just, I did a Thanksgiving one where it has a song where it goes, I got beans, greens, tomatoes, tomatoes, lamb, scrap. And it was just like, I just do funny clips and it just, that's really all I do. That's what you do? Oh, cool beans. How many uh, followers you got? 775. Nice. So you guys need to follow her. I'm just saying, okay? Support this little girl. She's adorable. I mean, she came over today. Um, I know her. I know her father, father and mother. And you know, I asked them, "Hey, does Pila want to do a, a video with me for YouTube?" And she's like, "Oh my goodness, she's so happy to do it." So that's what we're doing, and cutting turkey. So the great thing about this is, is that while we're cutting, the people don't really need to see us cutting or whatever like that. We can fast forward the cutting or we can put it on pause, either way. I think I'm just gonna pause you guys. Okay, so back real quick. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the chicken raw into my pan. Let's just flip you guys. Whoops. I could, you know what? I should be able to flip right, right? There's the pan. Here's the flipping. Okay. So we're going to put... Oh, this is easy peasy. Aren't you guys glad? Because usually I have to use my tongue or scissors or something or my mouth or something just to uh, open things. But this is going to go in here. And it's taking forever, but I'm gonna get this broth started and I'm checking the noodles to make sure they're not. This is taking forever. Okay, so I'm putting the broth in and what else I'm gonna do is I'm going to add, um, I'm going to add the meat and the celery and then we're gonna start cutting up the carrots, but I'll be back for that. Okay, so the noodles are done. And what I wanna do is, if you can see, I just got them out of the, uh, yeah, there's hot. Ah, it just went on my foot. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them with cold water because I don't want them to cook any longer. So I'm putting them with cold water, making sure that they won't cook longer because I'm gonna put them back into the other stuff when it's more done. So that's what you wanna do is rinse your nose with cold water. Like I said, you don't want them totally done. Mm. Yeah, they're still a little crunchy. Not crunchy, but a little hard. But that's what you want to do. So I'm rinsing them with cold water. And we will be back with the carrots. Okay, so I am going to peel carrots while Pila tells you about her famous smoothie bowls. So tell them what it is first. So everyone can make them. You just need a strong enough blender. So all you need is frozen fruit and um, yogurt and milk. That's all you need. Now you can choose any kind of fruit and you put that into the blender. Don't fill it all the way with fruit, just fill it like halfway. Then you put like a couple of scoops of yogurt, like five, and then you put some milk. It doesn't really matter how much milk you put. It depends on how slushy you want the um, smoothie bowl to be. Oh, great. Now, 
Now I'm starting stuff on fire, I think. Oh, I know it was. Ew, there we go. Don't worry, you guys, everything's okay. I'm not burning the house down like I did almost on Thanksgiving. I'm just saying. Yeah, okay. But I was, I was cooking this right here. See it? It's for the spoons. Yeah, I guess the end of it was um, next to the burner. <laughs> this is me cooking, okay? Sorry to interrupt the smoothie bowl process, but yeah, no, don't worry, don't worry. I'm okay, I'm okay. <laughs> and that is not part of the recipe of almost burning a thing that holds spoons. <laughs> But anyway, you just put milk to the top of it, and then you can put it in any kind of bowl you want. Then you can top it with coconut, dry fruit, you can top it with anything. And then you just go ahead and eat it. That's all you gotta do. <laughs> Isn't she adorable? Definitely follow her on TikTok, okay? The smoothie bowl recipe. Are you gonna put the smoothie bowl recipe on TikTok for them? Yes. Yes, okay. She will definitely put the smoothie bowl recipe on TikTok for you guys. So you guys can have that. And what else? What else? These carrots. Like, I got this cooking over here. You guys can see. Boom, there's a nail. But you can see, I got so much stuff going on right here. Now, where's the, will you open that drawer, honey, and get me a spoon? Um, like, no, no. Aha, spoon. Okay, so this is cooking. Like I said, the noodles are like, cold now so this is gonna have to cook so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put in seasoning I forgot to do that that might help so I'm putting in a couple chicken bouillons let them know how many so then well it's all to taste you guys like let me see if I can get you in the shot there we go there <laughs> so it's all to taste on how many you want to put in I am here open these up for me honey okay, okay. Cause, oops, there. Yeah, get them open. Cause I can't open crap right now, and this is not going right. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna put these in there. I'm gonna put them all in there, cause I don't know how many are left. But then we're gonna put on some garlic, bunch of garlic, and like I said, I do everything to taste. So garlic, salt, and pepper. Let's just throw some salt in there. Oopsies. Salt, some pepper, onion powder. This one got smushed. That one got smushed. You want to just throw it in here? Um. Can you get it in here? Oh, like that got smushed. That one got smushed. Okay. Well, then it means it'll dissolve faster, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Are these two done? Yep. Okay. Throw them in there. Ooh, whoops, now I just burned that down, okay. Yeah, this is gonna be amazing once it's done. It smells amazing. I yeah, wish we had smell-o-vision, okay? Because... Yeah, that would have been amazing. Mm-hmm, mm, garlic. Oh, I think he's thinking the garbage is there. Put that one in there? Oh, that one's powdery too, okay. And then we're gonna get a spoon. And my kitchen is so much bigger, you guys. It's like way bigger than the last apartment I had. Like, it's huge. As you can tell, you can see my living room there in the background, you know, and everything. And so I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good in my new place. So you got a little taste of Lizzie and how I'm living. Okay. Um, like I said, I'm just going to let this cook and I'm going to cut up the carrots. The carrots are still cutting. We're over here now. Still cutting up the carrots. And I don't know how many carrots that you guys want. Um, you can just still sit there, honey. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can still sit there. You don't have to face the camera. You can face me if you want. Um, so I don't know how many carrots you guys want um, in your, you know, soup. It's your choice of how many carrots you will want. Yeah. So. I'm, let's see, I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven's a good number. I got pretty big carrots, you know. So I think I'm going to put seven in there, maybe eight carrots. But I'm going to cut them up in little circles, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to pause. Yep. Okay, you guys. So 
This is another Lizzie mistake. Stand up, honey. You can stand up for this. <laughs> this is another Lizzie mistake. Look what I forgot. The onion. Yep. So you can add onion to your soup or not. We are going to add it now since I'm still cutting these crazy carrots. Like seriously, I honestly should have cut the carrots, you know, prep the carrots. So then that way there, I would not be waiting right now. Don't do the laser light on the video. Okay. okay. <laughs> She's playing with velvet with the laser. So she had the laser in her hand. Anyway, so I accidentally forgot the onion. So I'm going to add the onion in. But that's okay. It's a Lizzie mistake. That's why you guys love me because I'm not perfect. And I do things crazy like that. So I'm going to cut up the onion while I'm still cutting up the carrots, adding them into the soup and everything. And the noodles are still on the chill <laughs> okay everybody so we are back okay it's been cooking probably now for the last 20 minutes 30 minutes or so i'm gonna add the noodles they're in the strainer let me just move this over here so just wash my hands and everything so i'm gonna add the noodles like this just because i made too much noodles and like i said you kind of want to cook the noodles um a little bit light. I mean, not light, but not, you know, don't cook them all the way. And I made a lot of soup, as you can tell, um, but I also made a lot of noodles. So I kind of just want the noodles to be warmed up in the soup. I don't know if this is enough. Pila, is this enough noodles, honey? Let me see. <laughs> She's playing with velvet. You think? Look. Or do you think I should add more? Probably more? I think you should add more. More? Okay. Fill out over there. I don't want it to overflow. And she's watching Animania. <laughs> Woo! Okay, and we're burning stuff. We got fire going on. Okay, so one thing about gas stoves, you guys, don't try and start stuff on fire, okay? Like I just did. Everything okay? Yeah, everything okay. <laughs> I'm gonna burn the place down by the time I'm done with this. Okay. I think that's enough noodles. That's enough noodles. We got enough noodles in there. Put that in there. And we're just gonna kind of stir this. And the seasoning's great. This turkey noodle soup's amazing. I'm gonna let it cook for another five minutes, you guys, just to get the, uh, just to get it all in there and the noodles all in there and everything. And then it will be done. It'll be amazing. Okay, so we just finished this. Smile. Yep. Look at it, because this is going to be the thumbnail. Okay. So we just finished the soup and everything. It's super hot, you guys. And so we are going to try it. You can set it down now, honey. We had to do the thumbnail. <laughs> and so we're going to try it. But like I said, it's super hot. So... You want to blow some off? Makes it super hot, but it smells so good. Mmm. Actually, that's really good. Tell me what you think. A good. Mm-hmm. Turkey noodle soup, everybody. So amazing. We made it. You know. What is Velvet doing? Hold on. <laughs> You guys, it's not a video without this little girl. Oh, without the baby, right? Yep. It's not a video without the baby. Yes, I know, baby. I know, I know. Yep, and there's her tail. Okay, we love you guys. Velvet, say bye to everybody and don't ruin the camera. Say bye. There you go. Bye, guys. Ah, Velvet. Okay, <laughs> bye, guys. Love you. And then follow Pila on TikTok. Yep.